Shalom Akim, Shalom Shibel Yakane. First and foremost, I want to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakudash, Barakatha. I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone who grew well and that taught me this truth. And salutation out there to the hopeful elect, the brothers that are putting this work diligently, sincerely, and truthfully to USA Shalom. Okay? Hey, today's lesson is going to be on. Um, Basically, overcoming the trials and tribulations that's to come to this place, man. All right, about enduring, about uh, enduring the temptations, about the temptations that we will face. Okay, the hardships. Okay, so on and so forth. So I'm just gonna go into these uh, scriptures because the days we're coming into, like Paul said in Romans, uh, our our salvation is nearer now than when we ever believed. You know, roughly paraphrasing. So with the closing, and, and as we get closer to the kingdom, mine is going to get harder and harder. Okay, it's not going to get easier and easier. Okay, so that, uh, like spoken about in Revelation 12 and 12, you know, the devil know you have but a short time, so you're coming out with great wrath. That great wrath is talking about physically and spiritually, man. Okay, because these demons are coming on harder and harder. Okay, spiritually. All right, just like it says in Ephesians, we wrestle not against flesh and blood. All right, but against uh, uh, hot wickedness in high places, basically, roughly paraphrasing. Okay, so in all aspects, uh, Satan is about to start coming down real hard on brothers, all right, whether it be brothers, uh, family, uh, b brothers, uh, woman that they're dealing with, uh, uh, friends or whatever, you know, uh, little shit, uh, maybe, maybe it might be something they, they employ at their jobs, you know, any little thing to try to get underneath your skin, man, all right, so we got to stand bold, okay, you got to stay in the spirit, okay, you got to kind of, uh, get away from your carnal and fleshly thoughts, all right, start fasting more, okay, start pushing yourself more, Okay, pushing yourself past your limits, okay, mentally and physically, so you can get ready for these times to come, man. Like Jeremiah 30 and 7 said that that gray is late, that, that, that day is great. All right, Jacob's trouble. Okay. So we getting prepared for that, man, mentally, spiritually, and physically. Okay. Ecclesiasticus 2 and 1. My son, if thou come to serve the Lord, prepare thy soul for temptation. Okay. And we come in to serve the Lord. Okay. And we've been tempted. Okay. But um again. The times we coming into is that that temptation is going to start going up even even harder on brothers, man. Set thy heart aright and constantly endure, and make no haste in time of trouble. Okay, constantly endure. Okay, day in and day out. Okay. Cleave unto him and depart not away, that thou mayest be increased at thy last end. Okay, cleave unto him. Scriptures say, seek him ten times more. Uh, you know. Now that you've gone away, seek him ten times more. You know, roughly paraphrasing. And depart not away. Don't, don't lose the faith, man, because stuff's getting hard out here. Okay? said so he's going to chastise those who he love. Okay? Gold must be tried through the fire. Okay? And at the end, we're going to be increased. He's going he gonna to give us what we need, man. Okay? Whatsoever is brought upon thee, take cheerfully and be patient when thou art changed to a low estate. Okay, whatever is brought upon thee, whether good or bad, take cheerfully, man. Be happy about the when 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 them uh, sunshine uh, when them storms come. Okay, be happy when that sunshine come. Okay, you gotta be always be content, whether good or bad. Okay, don't ever get too high, don't ever get too low. Okay, you gotta kind of be in the middle somewhere, and be patient when thou art changed to a low estate. Okay, right now we are in that low estate, but real soon we're gonna be even at a lower estate before we get boomed up into Lord will it be given those spiritual powers. Because Esau's about to come out with some shit, man. We're not going to be able to do nothing against it. But have faith in our power to deliver us from it. For gold is tried in the fire and acceptable men in the furnace of adversity. Okay? For just like gold is tried in the fire, hey, Lord willing, we are those men that are gold, man. They said, I'll make a man more precious than fine gold. Okay? And acceptable men in the furnace of adversity. Best believe we're going to face a lot of adversity in these days to come, man. All right? Believe in him and he will help thee. Order thy way of right and trust in him. So we're supposed to just lean upon Yahweh by Shemiah by Shai. said he'll fight for us. Okay? So brothers need to start increasing their faith, man. Increasing their wisdom. Increasing their knowledge. Ye that fear the Lord, wait for his mercy and go not aside, lest ye fall. Okay? So it's just talking about trusting Yahweh by Shemiah by Shai, man. He's going to deliver us. He's going to do... He's going to make the impossible possible, man. Okay? Faith is, is the key thing, man. Ye that fear the Lord, believe him, and your reward shall not fail. Okay? We're not going to fail if we believe in Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, man. Okay? 
Ye that fear the Lord, hope for good and for everlasting joy and mercy. Okay? Look at the generations of old and see, did ever any trust in the Lord and was confounded? Or did any abide in his fear and was forsaken? Or whom did he ever despise that called upon him, that was sincere, that knew the names, that actually believed in this doctrine, that actually believed in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai? He never let nobody down, man. Never. Okay? So believe that he's not going to let you down, man. For the Lord is full of compassion and mercy, long-suffering and very pitiful, and forgiveth sins and saveth in time of affliction. All right? We, we come upon those times of affliction, man. Okay? Real, 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 real soon, man. All right? Uh, 1 Peter 1, 7. That the trial of your faith, being much more precious than of gold that perisheth, though it be tried with fire, might be found unto praise and honor, glory at their appearing of Yahweh Shai HaMashiach. Okay? Whom have not whom having not seen, ye love, and whom, though now ye see him, not yet believing, ye rejoice with joy unspeakable and full of glory. So we, it says, remember, it says, bless those who, who, who see not and believe, you know? So we didn't even see how it shy. This is all based off faith. We ain't even seen, we ain't even seen none of the miracles. And we believe this truth so heavily. That's a gift, okay? We just got to keep that faith, man. Lord willing, the Lord keeps that gift on brothers, man. All right, to endure uh, these times to come. Re receiving the end of your faith, even the salvation of your souls. Okay, that's what we aim to uh, achieve, man. Of which salvation the prophets have inquired and searched diligently, who prophesied of the grace that should come unto you. Hey, man, we prophesied this. You know, we prophesied the, the so-called UFOs, chariots coming and getting brothers. All right? The Lord giving brothers the spiritual powers, lifting up that standard. Okay? Hey, everything we speaking about in these scriptures is about to come to life. We about to really see it come to fruition. Okay? And that's going to be beautiful. That's going to really boost brothers' spirits and, and confidence up to a different level, man. Okay? To actually see the words that you spoke about in the scriptures come to life. And we're seeing it right now on a little side, on a little scale. But... Like to, to, to like, wait till the dollar crash. Wait till this mob come. Okay, wait till brothers get spiritual power. Wait till we see those chariots. Hey, brothers, about to be on a different vibration when all that happens, man. Matthew twenty four thirteen, but he that shall endure unto the end, the same shall be saved. And Lord willing, we can endure unto the end, man. Okay, the end meaning the end end. Okay. Right before the nuclear missiles hit, Lord willing, man. Okay? And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations, and then the end shall come. Okay? And that's what's being professed right now across the four corners of the world. Brothers out there in all different types of continents and countries bringing out this word, man. And it's full in sincerity. Okay? Not half assing the doctrine, not adding and taking away from the scriptures. Okay, preaching what basically Yahweh Shai was preaching when he was walking the world, man. What's got him killed, what's got him crucified, okay? What's the world hated him for it, okay? What's they are going to hate us for it, okay? Revelation 2.10 For none of those things which thou shalt suffer... Behold, the devil shall cast some of you into prison, you know, FEMA camps and whatnot, that ye may be tried. This is just a test. And ye shall have tribulation ten days. The Lord is going to deliver us. Be thou faithful unto death, and I will give thee a crown of life. The Lord is going to look out for us, man. Hey, whether we die or don't die, we're still going to win. You can't lose when you with Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. Because it said the dead in, in Christ shall rise first. So you end up being a martyr for the Lord, okay? You end up dying for this truth. Whatever happens. And the Lord might, might get an easy, swift death. You won't even feel it. Lord, take your spirit out your body before you even feel whatever is going to happen to you. Or it could just be a quick, short death. Head chopped off, shot in the head, whatever. Okay, Lord ain't going to let his men get tortured and, and be all messed up like that, man. That's that two. That's for the two-thirds and for the heathens that, that did him wrong, man. But for his men that stood firm, 
that, 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 that did everything that he required of them, that feared him, that sought him, that preached his word, that loved him, that followed his laws and commandments, okay, that professed his name and his son, okay, he going to look out for those men, man. Let's believe that, as the scriptures say, okay? He that have an ear, let him hear what the Spirit say unto the churches. He that overcometh shall not be hurt of the second death. Okay, that second death is, is that lake of fire, man, which is those thermonuclear missiles. Okay. Uh, Matthew 26, 41. Watch and pray that ye enter not into temptation. The spirit is indeed willing, but the flesh is weak. And this is why, you know, brothers got to start fasting more, you know. Hey, even start to work out, man. Because, you, hey, man, we're going to be in Jacob's troubles, man. We might have to flee out into the wilderness. You might have to go and run. You might have to go, you know, flee from people, man. And if you ain't in no type of shape to run 100 yards or 200 yards or may, shit, maybe even a mile, shit, might not eat, eat for a week. I mean, not a week. Might not eat for a day. All right? Might just have a little here and there, a little some berries or whatever, some 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 little nuts and then a little little thing of water just to you know fulfill you for that time being. But it ain't gonna be no full course home cooked meals like what you used to. It's not gonna be no sitting down at the table chilling, watching TV, eating mac and cheese, yams, and some good cooked meal. Hey, you might have to go and be scrounging around, man. You might have to get a little berry here, eat some wood bark, maybe eat eat a little locust. You know, get a little water from whatever you found, maybe a little rain, you know, a little river you seen. Hey, it's not going to be like how it is now. So brothers got to prepare their mindset. Brothers got to prepare their body, prepare their mental for what's going to come and not get so comfortable into what it is now. Okay. James 1 and 12, blessed is the man that endureth temptation, for when he is tried, he, was, he shall receive the crown of life, which the Lord hath promised to them that love him. Let no man say when he is tempted, I am tempted of God, for God cannot be tempted with evil, neither tempteth he any man. For every man is tempted when he is drawn away of his own lust and enticed. Then when lust hath conceived, it bringeth forth sin, and sin, when it is finished, bringeth forth death. Do not err, my beloved brethren. Okay, basically saying, you know, keep the faith, man. You're gonna be tried, and that that trials and tribulations that you that you being tested with is gonna is gonna truly test your faith in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And if you really truly trust in Him and believe in Him, man, because a lot of these people that say they believe in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, when shit get bad, they're gonna fold. They're gonna turn their back on the Lord, man, and be looking to save their own life and be going down to Egypt uh, for help. You know, the so-called government or whatnot. James 1, 3, knowing this, that the trial of your faith worketh patience. Okay, we got to be patient, man. We're going to suffer because the word patience means to suffer. Okay, the Lord going to test us, man. He's going to make sure that we really are his men. So he's going to put us to the test. Best believe it. One Peter four thirteen, but rejoice in as much as ye are partakers of Christ's sufferings, that when His glory shall be revealed, you may be glad also with exceeding joy. Okay, hey man, Lord willing that we, we the, the Lord honor us, man, for 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 everything we have been through, everything that we're going to go through. Okay, and He He put on that crown for us, man, and He He give us the blessings and He give us you know that rank, man, that hundred forty four thousand rank. Lord willing, we be those men, man. All right, this ain't for nothing. This ain't for naught. Okay, this is a great reward after this, man, to be able to uh, suffer and overcome and endure. Okay, these things to come. All right, there's a reward for that. 2 Timothy 2, 3. Thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Yahweh Shai Mashiach. Okay, and we are soldier for, for, for Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Okay, Lord willing, we get to prove ourselves and, and, and show that we are, man. And, and that's really the scriptures I wanted to bring out just to, you know, uh, boost brother's spirit, boost brother's confidence. Understand that, you know, hey, man, the times we're coming into, is, it's going to get real, real, man. And uh, we're going to see what brothers are made out of, man, when stuff hits a fan, when stuff that they used to, uh, everyday life gets taken from it, man. 
you know, when, when, when brothers ain't going to be able to enter those uh, supermarkets anymore because they're not taking that, 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 that kill shot, you know, they're not taking that MOB, okay, brothers ain't, brothers going to lose their jobs, you know, brothers might, but might be struggling, brothers might not even be able to pay rent or might not be able to live how they used to live in, you know, so we're going to see um, who, who, who brothers call on, how brothers act, you know, hey man, the real is going to stand firm, okay, the Lord going to look out for his, best believe that, okay, so with that, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Rakakwadash, Barakata. I'm going to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who rule well and that taught me this truth. And salutations out there to the hopeful elect, the buzz of the putting this work diligently, sincerely, and truthfully. To you, I want to say, Shalom, Amakim.